Hey everybody, it's David. It is Friday, November 9th. We are here outside Fox Studios. Well, actually, we're at Rancho Park, but we're about to walk to Fox Studios because there's going to be a very large demonstration of writers uh, for the writer's strike. They're all descending on News Corp today. It should be very interesting, very exciting. We're going to talk to some writers in the guild, see what their opinions are, maybe talk to some actors. It's going to be exciting, so check it out. Could you introduce yourself for the people who are watching? Just who? That's Julia Louis Dreyfus. <laughs> That's Brad Hall. He's a member of the WGA. He's a member of the Screen Actors Guild. And tell me, why are you here today? We're here in support of our strike. Yeah, ditto. <laughs> and why do you feel this strike is important? Um, uh, it's for the future of writers and creativity all over the world. And the Screen Actors Guild is up against uh, almost exactly the same issues in a couple months, which is why. And, and besides showing solidarity, I want to be here because it's going to have a lot of meaning and impact for the Screen Actors Guild. Um, we're striking for our future because we know that the internet is the future. And our the product that we've generated is now being viewed on the internet. So, And we're not being paid for it. We're getting zero. Zero. We're really only asking for pennies on the dollar. And uh, that's why it's brought out everyone in force here today because I think it's a unifying issue for our guild. And you've been a guild member for how long? <laughs> Oh, that's a good question. I'm going to say 1990. So you missed the first strike? I missed the first strike. Wow. So this is your uh, chance to put some time in representing the union? Absolutely. Now, to people who maybe think that a strike wasn't necessary or think that, you know, perhaps uh, the writers are asking for too much. What would you say to them to try to make them understand what this is about? Um, I think they have to understand about what's fair and that people produce products. And we as writers produce products that you should be paid for. It's as simple as any business uh, plan, business format, any product created in any other uh, uh, you know, business venture in the world. We create a product that we should be paid for. Now I know this is personally affecting you. You guys were set to sh uh, shoot the uh, last episode or the finale of the we Shield. Are, we are we are in the process of, of filming the finale episode of a seven-year series uh, without the participation of our executive producer Sean Ryan um, because he believes in this and he's putting his actions where his mouth is and 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 we're doing it with without him and and sadly uh, uh, we're going through this transformation without our, our, our the man in charge but we know that it's for the right reason and we're right behind him and we we'll support him and all the other writers on our show and the shows beyond so good on you man we're right with you and where are you here sir Ooh, ouch I'm here for the chicks. No, I'm here. I'm, a, I'm in the guild. I'm supporting my uh, my family. I, I, I sat in a writer's room for nine years with uh, Raymond. I know how hard they work. I know how much they deserve to get what's fairly their share. So I'm here to support them. And, and somebody put it. Somebody, someone else put it the best. We're very close to coming to agreement because we're asking for next to nothing and they're offering nothing. So we're very close. I've been there when they were fighting for reruns, then residuals, now DVDs, internet. Each time it's something different, but we just kind of keep up and we have a sort of group here today that I think will work this out. I'd love to see this end quickly. And what do you say to people who say, oh, TV writers, they already make too much money, or oh, you know, they're <laughs> not, you know. Uh, Come stop by my apartment, <laughs> see how we really live. <laughs> How does this strike differ from the strikes that you've been involved in in the past? It's bigger and better and it, it occurs at a more crucial time uh, for working people in America. Do you feel this is connected to some of the larger issues? I think this is connected to every large issue that affects the American family because this is a piece of the American family.
Okay, well the rally has officially just ended. Um, I wasn't able to get everything, but Jesse Jackson spoke, uh, Norman Lear spoke, a variety of writers spoke. It was definitely a very strong showing. Here today at Fox Studios, the writers want their fair share, and they are here to make it known that that's what they want. This is David coming to you from Los Angeles, California. We'll see you next time.